All right, let's go ahead and open up some of these babies up and show you what's inside these things. Might as well start off with the heart, uh, the uh, power supply. We got our power supply. Wow, very nice packaging for power supply. Got a carry bag for your cables. What you need that for, I don't know, but you, you have a carry bag. <laughs> I guess for the cable I don't use, right? Cords, motherboard, power cord. Lots of cords. You're not going to go wrong with the cords of these things. By the way, triple SLI on this thing, so you get VGA, six VGA cords, right, for triple SLI. Well, we won't be doing that. We'll just put one power card. So there'll just be plenty of power for what I'm going to use it for, so. Okay. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of the cords and the mother box. We got plenty of power. It screws them out the screws them out the power supply adapter for the motherboard Velcro strips. And the power supply itself. Very nice packaging, this thing. Very nice. Book. Man, they went all out packing. Look at this thing. It's in a bag all by itself. Very nice. Hmm. I like it's all modular. That's what I like about this thing. Look at the size of that fan on that thing. It's a good one. That's a good one. The NVIDIA GTX Titan X. Cannot wait to see how this thing performs. Okay. What's this? Bonus. No, oh, you gotta have a poster, right? You never tight necks. You gotta have a poster, right? Alright, oh it only jizz, but we'll find out what it is. That's your stickers. Because if you're putting this video card in your computer, guess what? It is uh, you are an enthusiast, so they they give you this sticker to prove it, so and the little emblem you have in there. Little emblem, CD, and book. SLI cables. Power supply cables. <laughs> VGA to DVI. Really? I don't think so. I won't be using that. DVI, it's got three HDMIs, and a display port. The monitor I have has, uh, has uh, I just got a new, I, I, used a, I use a Vizio 43 inch monitor, and uh, it has a uh, capability of doing 60 hertz 4K, and I needed an HDMI 2, which the current computer I have now doesn't have that, but this baby does. This will push the pixels out there. So no problem. Pushing 60 hertz, 4K. All right, the motherboard, Asus 
X99 Deluxe. Package really nice. Just hope it works as good as it's packaged. Eight slots. Eight slots. Remember, this is for another first time I'm going to build a computer without a sound card. I can use the onboard sound because it's not really a USB 3.1, right? This is a, a header for more fans. This is gonna have a lot of fans. I'll be using this thing. M2 adapter, won't be using that. And lots of cords. Cords. Back plate. This thing has a little controller on it to control the. Uh, this is the actual Wi Fi antenna. Okay. We have one, two, three, four. Oh, there's two in there. Okay, good. Gonna say it. Not a lot of two, four, six, eight. All right, I'll settle for that. Eight's good. More jumpers. Your motherboard jumper. I really like Aces. Does that with her case? Triple SLI. There you go. Three-way SLI, which we won't be doing. Got a power supply and a motherboard that does it, but that's kind of crazy. And a mount for the uh, antenna. All right. A couple books. User guides. Okay. Lots of books. And the water cooler. New to the water cooler scene, so. Should be interesting. Open this thing up. All right. With some brackets, different size for AMD and Intel. We have the pump itself. Already got silver paste on it already, which is nice. And then the radiator protected by a sleeve. Well, I can have a car radiator on my computer. Isn't that nice? This sucker is huge. Has dual 140 millimeter fans that go on this radiator. That is a monster. And the fans that we're not going to use, they'll stay in the case because we're going to use the new ones that I got. They're quieter, smoother operation. So that's the cooler. This is a case, okay? Gotta have a nice house for all those components, right? Gotta have a nice house. So, we're gonna have a nice house. Little levers here to open the door up. You see it's got a separate area here for the hard drive, separate area. Very nice vent in the middle here. Okay, this is, I really like this too. Got the thing. Hard drive bays here. Snap out, slide out. Very nice. Yep. You got 
two, four, six drives I can have in there. Fan down below. I have some more drives in here. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six SSDs in here. A lot of room. Accessory box. Another magnet door. Back in the motherboard. It's got fan headers there too. I got lots of fan headers. I can put thousands of fans in here, this thing. Be cool, isn't it? Wouldn't it? Another open the door on this side. The back of the drives. The cables will come out. Okay. Okay. It's got a hole right through the center there. You see that? It's, the, it's, the filters in here, right in here. Filters in here. Got a bracket up front. Filter in the back. Filter in the back. Okay. Here's your. Uh, Couple cables, you get some, give you a couple SATA cables. Not many, four, eight thousands of drives, and there are only four cables. Kind of bizarre. Anyway, book and a cloth. Here's the cloth to wipe the, to wipe the case off because it just picks up dirt. Wow. Oh, it's nice and light. Those doors off of there. 